I mean, I always work more off stage than on stage. And, and when I was down, I told the things that was unbelievable. You know, they didn't have to do that. Um, so I think you're doing a great job. I just want to congratulate you. And uh, so, I usually, in the English language, I don't care how can I help you. Because that means you're Humpty Dumpty and I'm going to put you back together. Mm -hmm. I say, how can I be useful to you? That I don't work on you or for you, I do it with you. I invite you that we're together. And sometimes I take two chairs. And I'm serious, you know, I'm kind of very serious about life. Because suicide is just rampant. Mm -hmm. So I take two chairs and I just put it like this. So because I am here doing it, and we make a contract that you're not going to mess up on me. <laughs> See? And, and they know that I give my heart and soul, and, and, and if you don't come on time, I start without you. And it's very hard when the parents pay for therapy. Many times you're throwing your money out because unless you're willing to pay something for it. Um, so don't bring your child to the therapist and thinking, oh, somebody's going to fix my kid. No, troubled children cause trouble. So then you have to look at the whole family dynamics and, and see what's going on between mom and dad. But you, the teachers here, and <clears throat> You have the best parents here because Jewish parents are on it. You see, they're very proud. Yeah. So that's good. But how do you deal with difficult parents? Who <laughs> <laughs> pay a lot of money. You, and they want you put them in the, 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 the part of the school. <laughs> see? So how do you be very polite and set boundaries and limits? And, uh, to fight, not to create mm -hmm. Yeah, so you have to be good psychologists and good diplomats and, and, and good parents, to the parents. You're actually training the parents how to be good parents. You know, what it takes to get married, nothing. <laughs> you don't get any preparation in America. A lot is maybe not in my and, and children raise children, and it's terrible what's going on with the drugs and alcohol, and, and they don't want to get well either. They think we you know, school. So at the San Quentin prison, now they have psychologists that they take kids who are just totally uncontrollable. And they put them there for one day. What happens when you are in jail? So we are here to prevent something like this. So you want to go? <laughs> <laughs>